All right, guys, this is Chris with 1441 Engraving. We're out downtown Brunswick, Georgia. Beautiful Georgia, beautiful downtown Brunswick. And we are going to So Glow Guitar Gallery, downtown Brunswick. So we're gonna walk in here and uh, you're gonna come with me. And we're gonna look at some custom guitars that uh, we collabed on. Not like we planned this, but hey guys! Hi, Chris! Hey, Chris! <laughs> wow! Amazing to see you here. <laughs> so let's go introduce you to the gang, and then we'll take a look at the shop. This is Crawford. Hi. He's our friendly uh, owner of Soglo with Preacher over here. Hey, Chris! Hey, buddy. It's not like I've been in here before. <laughs> but uh, so let's go through some of these guitars and what they offer here. Uh, right to the left, we got some ukuleles, and of course, all along the bottom, you got all these amps, and they got some killer amps. We'll go over those in a second. Some bass, and some more custom uh, guitars, and so forth. On the floor, they have in the center, really good guitars. And if you're a gearhead or guitar gearhead, you want to come in here and check some of these out. Love this color. That's a sweet looking guitar right there. Anyway, so some of the um, some of the amps they have for sale, one of them in particular, the valve train line. I'm not the salesman for the store, but Crawford and those guys can tell you how sweet it's those are. Amp. It's a lovely amp, darling. Being very but they carry all kinds of um, used and new guitars, different lines, upscale to more beginner. In some vintage gear. Look at that. What the heck is that thing? That's a 68 uh, silver tone. Get it. Wow, that's cool. Anyway, this acoustic amp's been bothering me to go home with me, but I resisted the urge. And again, accessories and uh, so forth. Let's go over to the, the elite side of the room. And we get more of the um, the custom. Hey Crawford, you're you're famous. I am famous. That is awesome. I'm, I'm infamous. Infamous. Move this chair. Anyhow, uh, our first guitar, nice Fender Telly. It's gorgeous. Down here, you got a couple other guitars. Wow, look at this Zemitis. <laughs> That's a great looking guitar, isn't it? Very good. It's actually mine, and I'm selling it here at SoGlo. But anyways, full disclosure. But that is a sweet guitar. Ibanez. Got an Ibanez at home that plays amazing. Anyway, so we go back to these, right? Um, here's one of their custom guitars. SoGlo's SoGlo uh, so Guitar Custom Line. And they hand build these things from scratch. Just beautiful paint and the details, laser engraved bridge. Laser engraved color filled logo at the top, headstock. Nice tuners, man. The detail they put into these are really nice. Laser engraved neck plate in the back with the serialized or seal number, serial number. Another Soglo custom. What do they call this? Hand hand aged, I guess. Relic. relic. Hand, hand relic. But uh, cute, cool telly hand relic. This is brand new, guys, and they play great. Again, engraved, color filled headstock by fourteen forty one engraving. And again, that laser engraved neck plate with the serial number. Cool. What number is this one? 14? 14. Another Soul Glow Custom Strat. That's cool, man. The texture. The pictures really don't do it justice. I don't know how to... Best way to show you guys. But really nice. 
engraved color filled headstock at the top. Beautiful. Look at that roasted, roasted maple, I think, neck. Again, laser engraved neck, That's neck plate. Babinga. babinga? Roasted? Nope, just straight just up. Just straight up babinga. Not bazinga. Nope, bazinga. Bazinga, but. Bazinga, babinga. And then headstock, color filled, laser engraved. This is my favorite, by the way. This is my favorite. This isn't for sale because it's a customer's that they're hanging in here, but it's absolutely gorgeous. Look at that binding. And the color is awesome. I keep trying to steal it, but they keep catching me. And then the, the laser engraved custom neck plate is one of my favorites that we've done. Um, it's actually backwards, but... Let's pick it up. Here we go. Picture the owner of the guitar. Just, man, just a really great guitar. Sorry, it's so close, but anyways, here we go. How's that? And the Gretsch. Here's a splatter caster that I was trying to get a friend of mine to come in here the other day. We were talking guitars, and I said, have you seen the Splattercaster? Very cool. And all your accessories that you could ever want. That's right. Dad's right. Some guitar, I mean, uh, some Sogo t-shirts. One of the local bands, Pine, the Pine Box Dweller t-shirts. Another custom up top, that, that came out cool. What are you calling this, guys? The what? Oh, this? No named it? Hasn't named it yet? I don't know what the, what neck stock, what neck plate we have on there. My face, I think. It's probably nothing yet. Oh, your face? <laughs> oh, how do we get, you gotta look at that. How can we get that down? Can you reach it? Is your face on the back of that? It might be. If not, it's uh. Uh oh, oh, there we go. Yep. Oh man. Guess whose guitar that is? I'm just saying. You got that guy and that guy. I'm I'm guessing that guy. That is so cool. Thank you for sharing, sir, and yeah. risking all lost as you But preacher, what do you do here? I sit down. <laughs> He sits down and he does all the repairs and repairs. Yeah, uh, this is his office, man. Anything luthier related? Anything with strings? Put it that way. Anything with strings? No saxophones? No, we said no. Okay. What if um, what if Kenny G came in and wanted you to mess with his saxophone? What would you say? Get out. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> and all your strings. Preach your heart at work. All right, well, that's about it, guys. Welcome to Soul Glow Guitar Gallery in downtown Brunswick, Georgia. Uh, 1441 Engraving uh, helps them with all their custom guitar parts and so forth. And um, that's about it. We're signing off. You guys got anything to say on for the YouTube channel, for the YouTube audience of what, one? When are you leaving? <laughs> I got to go. <laughs> See you guys. Take care. Thanks for watching. Oh. I'm supposed. What am I supposed to say at the end of a YouTube video? Uh, please like and uh, like and subscribe to the channel. It really helps us out, and it really helps them out. Not really, but it it's what you're supposed to say, right? So, anyways, take care, guys. Quit talking. <laughs>